What's up, guys? This is your girl, Kara. Thanks so much for coming back to my channel. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell so that you're notified every time I upload a video. Today's video, we're going to be discussing five fragrances that you can purchase that'll help jumpstart your collection. So if you're interested, just keep on watching. Yeah. No, I really can't complain. Okay, guys, so the first scent that we're going to talk about today is from Zara, and it's Ebony Wood. And this scent, guys, it's an amazing scent. It has the notes of ebony, pink pepper, and clove. And for me, it's the clove for me. The clove is so strong, but it smells so good. Now, with cloves, when I first saw it online, I'm thinking for clove, that's something I would wear like in the fall or the winter. But... This is honestly, and I think this the pink pepper jumping out. I would wear this all year round. I would wear this all year without a doubt. It's not super strong, so it's not like beast mode where it's going to jump when you're walking in a room. It's going to jump out at people. But if you come in my area, if you come near me, you can definitely smell it. And it'll at you. Someone will ask you, well, what do you have on? Because it smells that good. Oh my God, I wish y'all could smell it. Y'all need to go get this. <laughs> it's an amazing price price point. Um, my bottle, I paid $29.99, $29.95, I believe, for it. And during Christmas, well, Black Friday, they had a Black Friday sale. And I paid, I got this size bottle and I also got a travel size. And I think I paid $29.95 for that. So I actually have a backup with it. It doesn't last all day i could get probably like five hours so i don't mind i don't mind that i would decant this but i have the travel spray now so if i need it i'll just put you know my travel spray in my bag if it's that serious or where i'm going but it really is an amazing scent it's a great price point and it will help you definitely to jumpstart your collection so that is zara's ebony wood okay so the next fragrance that we're going to talk about before I show you the fragrance, let me just give y'all a little disclaimer. I'm a little embarrassed because I'm pretty much done with the bottle. <laughs> and I need to get a new one. And I just haven't had a chance to purchase a new one. I have so many other fragrances that I'm using. I just didn't have a chance to buy a new one yet. But that fragrance is <laughs> YSL Leap Intense. And before we even talk about the scent, the bottle is gorgeous. It's so gorgeous. My light is messing up, but I will pop a picture up so you guys can see it. The bottle has this gold YSL sign on it. And if you play, if you place your fragrances on a vanity or a dresser, it just looks so pretty. It looks so luxe on a dresser or in a vanity. It's a gorgeous bottle. They, they want me with the bottle <laughs> before I even smelled it. Now the smell of it, this is not for the little girls. I, this is just my opinion. This is for a grown woman. This is for a woman that is getting into fragrances. Oh my God, it smells so good. The notes, <laughs> the notes of this fragrance is lavender, it's essence, it's orange blossom. I have my notes here, y'all. That's why I'm looking down. I can't remember all this. I can smell it, but that's why I'm looking down. <laughs> it's orange blossom. It's orchid and it's warm vanilla. And guys, oh my God, that's just what it is. It's like a warm floral, a warm floral set. It's, it's so good. Now, this, I would wear this if I worked in the office. I would definitely wear this in the office setting. Um, I think that it transitions well into night. So if you wore this to work and you were going out for happy hour or something after work, this will be something that you would freshen up with. It does last all day um, when I wear it. Um, it will last all day on me when I wear it. I do have a, I put this one in a set, I believe. So I do have a, um, I'm sorry, no, I didn't buy it in a set. I actually put some in a little decan bottle because I was traveling and I didn't want to take the bottle. So if I am going somewhere, I just take my little decan with me. Half of the time, I don't need it because the scent lasts all day. Now this price point, this was a little bit more expensive. So they range between 85 and $140. My opinion, 
Don't buy this little bottle. Go ahead and buy the hundred and forty dollar bottle. Macy's, Nordstrom, somebody is gonna have a sale on it. It's worth it. It is definitely worth it to jumpstart your collection, and that is why it's so leap intense. Okay, guys. So this next scent that we're gonna talk about is Tiffany Intense. And guys, this bottle is so pretty to me. When I first saw this bottle, I said the bottle looks like the perfume should smell good. <laughs> and that's exactly what it smelled like. It smells good. This bottle looks amazing on a vanity, just the way it is. Now, I'm not somebody that gravitates to silver. I just don't. I'm not a silver person. I like more gold. You can tell. I like gold. But just the look of this is just so simple. It's pretty. Even if it's empty, it still looks pretty. The one that they had in the store was dang near empty. But it still looked nice sitting up there with the other fragrances. The notes in this one is peppercorn, iris, and amber. Yeah. And you can really smell, you're going to smell the iris more than every, anything. So you, I think if you're somebody who likes really fresh scents, you would kind of gravitate to this. And it's a scent that you can wear every day. You can wear it to the office. Um, it would, I don't know if I would wear it out, like going out, if I were going to a club, I don't go to clubs, but if I were going to a club, then yeah, I don't think I would wear that, I wouldn't pull for this, but it's a good scent to wear to work, it's a good scent to wear to church, um, if you're going, drop the kids off, or you gotta go on to school, it's good, you can watch with your girlfriends. It's a nice set. It really is. It's not doing too much. Now, this price ranges from $115 to $145. And um, I think it's a decent price. I think it is worth the $115. And if you get the bigger bottle, it is worth that. And it is a set that I would definitely wear all year. I bought this in the summertime. So, I kind of thought, because if I smelled it in the summertime, I'm like, I'll probably only wear this in the summer. I'm not going to wear this no other time. Y'all, I still wear it. I wear it in the house. If I don't want to wear nothing else, like if I can't find what I want to wear that day, this is always my go-to. Because it's not doing too much. And then I still have a scent on it. I have a scent on it. It smells good. So, guys, this is another one. Another vendor. Tiffany and Tess. Okay, guys. We're getting down to the wire. Okay. So, the next one is going to be Guerlain. Bon Guerlain. And, guys... fragrance is one of my favorite actually this fragrance is inspired by angelina jolie and if angelina jolie smell like this good god <laughs> i would never think that she would smell like this you would have to go and experience it yourself now i'm gonna tell you the notes like i've been doing the, the top notes are bergamot, mandarin, and pear. The middle is neroli, jasmine, and lavender. The base is going to be iris, vanilla, and y'all, the sandalwood. The sandalwood is what got me with it. Now, this scent, it was a blind buy for me. I had never smelled this perfume, ever. I saw a bunch of reviews on it, and everybody kind of said the same thing. They liked it. Some people said they loved it, but they would they wish they had a bigger bottle. But the downside, it doesn't last that long. So for fragrance is not lasting that long. That's not really a deal breaker for me. If it smells good, I'm gonna dress. I wear warm vanilla sugar, the body cream with it. And I use the body cream and I use the body wash or any body wash that has like vanilla or anything in it. And I get a better experience with the fragrance so i don't mind that i'm going to buy a bigger bottle of this even with it not having that long lasting ability and that's better than a body spray i'll tell you that so i believe it is worth it now the price point it's about 85 to 145 dollars so it's still you know like the other ones it's not super expensive 
but it's an amazing scent, y'all. It is really, really sexy. I think that it does transition well into night. Um, I would wear this if I was going out on a date or going out. I would definitely, going out to dinner, I would definitely wear this. I would wear this to work. If I were at the office, the corporate office, it still smells, it just smells good. You're gonna love it. So y'all, get to a Macy's or wherever you go. Uh, Macy's, Nordstrom, Lord Teller. They still got Lord Teller. I don't know. I know we don't have, I live in North Carolina. They don't have one here. But <laughs> go wherever you need to go and get your nose on this. Guerlain, mon Guerlain. <laughs> okay, guys. So the final set that we're going to talk about for our top five is going to be Valentino, Donna Ford, and Roma. And again, beautiful bottle. Very pretty bottle. Love it. And this smell, this is a floral. But y'all, it is sexy. This is so sexy, and I'm just going to keep it a book. Every time I've ever worn this fragrance, <laughs> and I'm all, I've worn it like it never is that, I've gotten a compliment from a man. And even if he was married, it was not flirting, but like, where did you, like, what is that? And I think they thought it was something, like, they couldn't get in a store or something that was super expensive, and it's not. This is so pretty. It is so sexy. It transitions well into the night. You could wear this to work if you wanted to. I probably wouldn't, but I, I can see someone wearing this to work. If we were, like I said, happy hours, going out, having drinks, doing whatever, when you get off, this is, this is bomb. It will transition in the night. Now, the notes, the notes of black currant, jasmine, and bourbon vanilla. And that vanilla, it is strong, but it's pretty, okay? You're going to get attention if you ask. I'm just going to keep it real. You are. And if you don't want the attention, don't put it on. But you're going to get attention wearing this. It lasts long. You can still decant it. That's not a problem. But it does, to me, it lasts long. It lasts long on me. So, y'all, get your hands on it. That Latino Donna Borna five bangers that will help to jumpstart your collection again this is just my opinion we just having fun <laughs> now i do have an honorable mention now this one is completely out of that price range but it is a scent that you know if you just want to get just jump right on in like just past the designer fragrance portion and all of that, you can go ahead and you can get what everybody gets, and that's Macy Francis Kirchner Baccarat Rouge 540. And guys, this is an amazing scent that to me, there's nothing else out there that smells like it. That's just my opinion. And it's 300 of you, $325. So I don't know if you want to just jump in and pay that, but it does smell amazing. It is an amazing scent. Now, the notes in this one is jasmine, it's saffron, cedar, and amber green. Now, it does this thing on me, and when you watch videos, you'll hear people that wear it, they'll say it, and it does it on me too. I don't smell it, but other people will smell it. And it also, if I spray it, because I spray my clothes too, if I spray my clothes and I don't necessarily want to wash them that same day, I will smell it like three days later on the same shirt. So it's lasting. <laughs> it lasts. To me, it does. They have another one, the Baccarat Rouge Extrait. Um, I heard that one last way longer, but it's a different scent than this one. It smells completely different. I've heard of people mixing those two as well. But this... There's nothing out there like it. In my opinion, there's nothing designer. I haven't smelled anything in my experience. Now, my fragrance experience, I've been doing this like about a year and a half. So I don't have like 300 fragrances in my house. I got I got some stuff. I got, I got, I got a little something. It is growing, but I don't have anything in my collection that smells like this. And I have four MFK fragrances. So... <laughs> This is definitely different from anything else that I own. So y'all, 
Go smell it. If you want to be a baller, <laughs> Mason Francis, Kurt Jean, Baccarat Rouge 540. <laughs> okay, guys, that concludes the video. Thanks so much for watching this video. I really do appreciate it. Guys, let's engage down below. Let me know what you think about these fragrances if you own them. Or let me know if you have any questions. Also, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, okay? Subscribe. You don't watch the whole video. You might as well subscribe. <laughs> subscribe, guys. Hit the notification bell so that you know every time that I post a video. Also, head on over to Instagram. Follow me on Instagram at Kara underscore Coop. It's lit over there, okay? I'm a little bit of a jokester, so if you're sensitive, still come on over. I still want you to follow, okay? <laughs> but for real, thanks, guys. Peace and blessings. <laughs>